anything worse than a drawer full of orphan socks? I mean, yes. what do you do? Do you keep them? Do you toss them? Well, you don't waste them. Fret no more, my friends. Today we're going to show you some crafty ways to put those socks back in the game. It's time to sock it to me. <laughs> You know my favorite way to recycle clothes is turning them into other clothes. I'm gonna show you how to make these old socks into some fashion forward arm warmers. Okay, first you start with a pair of long socks like I have here, this one lonely sock, I can't find his friend. Okay. So I'm going to cut the foot part off the sock so you just have one long piece like that, okay? Then you put the sock against your hand like this and you figure out where your thumb's gonna be. See that, guys? You need a little thumb hole. Mm -hmm. So all I have be to do careful. is chop I know. Okay, here we go. There, I did Perfect. it. It's there, you guys. It made a friend. Hi. Now for the fun stuff. It's time to decorate. So you can do a number of things to bling this baby out. Okay, so I'm gonna add rhinestones. I'm gonna use my trusty glue gun here. I'm gonna put a couple there. One, two, three, four. And then you just stick the rhinestones right on it, however you want. You could go Michael Jackson if you want. Like you're making it. eyes. Right? Oh. I'm going to make it look like a worm. Okay, yeah. great. And when you're done, ta da, you guys, you have awesome blossom sock on it. That's really cute. I like what it. What you got, Lonnie? Good job, Jeannie. When I'm rushing to get ready, the last thing I have time for is burning my hands on a cup of coffee. Well, thank goodness for socks. They can keep your. <laughs> What y'all laughing at? <laughs> I use my socks to keep my drink warm and my hands safe, okay? Let me show you how to make sock coffee cozy, all right? First, you take a cute little sock like this, and you cut it, like, right above the ankle like that. Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> then you take that sock and you put it Cover it in your, um, your favorite uh -huh. coffee cup. Because uh -huh. sometimes that cardboard stuff don't work. You know, you ever burn yes. your hand with the cardboard, yes. and I get mad, and I want to sue. But I can't do that, right? And if you got extra, you just cut it off right here at the end. The one thing I like about coffee mugs is that they always look really cool. So I have to add some bling to it. And you can get this from an arts and crafts store. Look at this bling. Oh, yeah, y'all ain't laughing cute. now, huh? That's really cute. I like that one comes out just like this. Ooh, you can add oh, that's really cute. Money, you add your favorite them. cup of coffee. You don't get your hands burnt. And it, it'll help it stay warm, too. So, see? Uh-huh. I like How it. How cute is my soft coffee cup? Well, uh, go ahead, you guys, you guys know I'm a neat freak, so I'm using my socks to make a sock sweeper. Oh, First, goodness. Yes, it's so easy. First, you're going to take a fuzzy sock like this. I like to use the fuzzy ones because they pick up more dirt, and I'm going to just stretch it out really good like this. Don't hurt yourself. Please. I'm not. Next, you're going to slip the sock over your mop sweeper and just use it as normal. Here, Lonnie. Can you hold this up for me, mm. please? Okay. Oh, you have to put your coffee down. Okay. Though. Okay. You. Watch. All you have to do is just Ooh, put this over. Here. Yes. This is great. I'm gonna use all my ex-boyfriend's socks. <laughs> <laughs> and then you can even squirt some cleaning solution on the floor as you go. And with this, you'll have dust-free floors in no time. So scrub away with your instant sock sweeper. <laughs> See. It's so easy, and that's how you sock it to me. Instead of mourning the loss of lost socks, put the survivors to work. For more information, check out TheReal.com.